What up, wrestling world? It's your boy Heel, and I am back with a new video. So, there's a picture on social media right now that it was taken by WWE NXT champion Finn Balor, and he's taking a picture in front of TNA headquarters doing the DX cross chop. So, as many of you may know, or you not known, WWE NXT is currently doing a house show, a live event, as of this recording, in Nashville, Tennessee. And as you all know, Nashville, Tennessee is the home of TNA Impact Wrestling. Their main offices are in Nashville. So from what it looks like, this is what I'm assuming now, okay? I could be wrong here. Don't quote me on it. WWE told their talent before the show, hey, you know what? Walk around the town, get something to eat, you know, get to know the place, sightsee, if you will. And I'm sure Finn Balor with others walked around the town and they happened to bump into TNA headquarters. And I guess Finn Balor, out of humor, nothing serious, took a picture in front of the, you know, the offices, and did the cross chop, the DX chop, and that's it. And this got a lot of people talking on social media. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Hell, even YouTube videos were done on this as well. And this is my honest take on it. I don't think it was meant to be taken serious. Like people are right now. Like, oh my god. Shots fired. LOL TNA. It's NXT versus TNA. It's TNA versus NXT. What have you. Put it this way, okay? If you are someone out there. And you have a disdain for TNA. Maybe at one time you were a TNA fan, but TNA did something to push you away. You look at this and say, LOL, this is funny. Bah, ha, ha. Fuck TNA. TNA going under. Good job, Finn Balor. You're the man, Finn. You're the man. You know, what have you. Okay? Now, if you're someone out there and you are a TNA diehard through thick and thin, Despite all the years that TNA's put their fans through and what have you, okay? And you still are sticking by them. You're looking at this and saying, how dare you, Finn Balor? How dare you, NXT? I guarantee you, Vince and Triple H told Finn Balor to do this on purposely, what have you. It's blind hate. I'll be very honest, okay? I don't think that WWE told Finn Balor to do this, even though, yeah, I get it. I agree. WWE has this mentality that they're the only company around, even though they've acknowledged Ring of Honor, they've acknowledged New Japan Pro Wrestling, but they don't acknowledge TNA, as if TNA doesn't exist for WWE. Now, just because the company feels that way, it doesn't mean that the roster itself, whether it's the main roster or NXT, which in reality is WWE developmental system, they feel that way. I'm sure the roster, the talent in WWE, they know about TNA, they know about Ring of Honor, they know about New Japan and the indies and what have you. I'm sure the talent itself, they watch the products that's out there besides WWE. But again, you know, honestly, it's not meant to be taken serious, even though... Uh, TNA wrestler Grado, who also wrestles in the UK on the indies, responded to this with a picture of himself, and it says, at WWE Balor, shots fired, bro. And as you all know, Grado and Finn Balor, or Prince Devitt, however you still want to call him as, they're very good friends in real life. And in this picture, you see Grado literally next to a door that says, employees only, with a WWE logo. And you can tell the person taking the picture was Finn Balor. It looks like Finn Balor. Who knows? I could be wrong. It has the palm trees behind you there. So you can tell this was in Florida. When Grado came over for the TNA Impact tapings in Florida. As you all know, the Impact Zone is in Orlando. And WWE Performance Center, Full Sail University is also in Florida. And also, TNA executive Bob Ryder responded to this and wrote the following. And I quote on Twitter. At WWE Balor, thanks for visiting the office. We were all happy to meet you. Please give at Triple H and at Steph McMahon our best regards. Now, I'll be very honest. I don't think he actually walked into the office to meet the TNA executives, whatever it may be. I just feel like, yeah, he just walked by the office, took a picture, and left. Because why would Finn Balor, let's be real here, okay? How awkward would that would have been? Him wearing a WWE polo shirt, walking into a TNA headquarters. Seriously. Now, mind you, at one time, TNA could have really signed Prince David, but they chose not to. Or they could have come to a deal back in the day. But that's in the past, okay? But for all of you out there who are saying, oh, TNA needs to retaliate now. Oh, they got to send Eric Young. They got to send Abyss. They got to send Bobby Roode. They got to send Rockstar Spud over to the Performance Center, over to Full Sail University to invade NXT or send them to Connecticut to invade WWE. 
No, that's the least of their worries right now. TNA right now has a lot on their plate to even worry about Finn Balor, who was faced here. He's in developmental. Do he deserve to be there? No, but he's there. He's the NXT champion. NXT, I get it. For a lot of people, it's the hottest thing going right now in wrestling. But people forget that NXT is WWE developmental system. It's not the alternative to WWE. But with that being said, TNA needs to worry about Bound for Glory being a successful show. Making sure that the fans who purchase a ticket to the event, who are ordering it on pay-per-view, are going to get their money's worth. They need to worry about this whole TV deal issue with Destination America. Either they're going to resign a new deal, or if not, they're going to go find the new deal. They have a lot on their plate that this is something minor with Finn Balor. Either way, listen, either you like this or not, what you saw with Finn Balor doing this picture, either way, you feel some type of way. Drop me a comment down below with your thoughts on all of this. You can follow me on Twitter, at HeelSteven. Make sure you like all my videos, and as always, hate, comment, and subscribe. Until next video, I'm Heel Steven, signing off. Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh.